Hey everyone, so I am doing this look today. If you are interested in knowing how I did it, please keep on watching. If you're not, then let me just let you know that I was in a video. Um, it's by one of our favorite rappers, which his name is Wax. And if you go on my main page, I favorited the video, so it's one of my favorite videos. Besides makeup, I am extremely into music, so if you notice, most of my favorites is all music. But anyways, um, me and my husband and my cousin were extras in a wax video and the song is awesome. From the time that we did the filming until the video is out, the song has been stuck in my head. That's all I keep listening to. I keep watching the video. Not just because I'm in it, because you could hardly even see me. I'll hurry up and put a few pictures on the parts that I am in. So yeah. Um, anyways, um, check out the video because the video is awesome. Um, everyone there was great. Check out Wax. Don't forget to subscribe to him and all that fun stuff. So, anyways, um, yeah, like I said, watch the video. Awesome video. And just watch it like this. Because there's so much going on. Like, the video is so fast and upbeat and it's a party song. And it's just like, like, the vi it's crazy. So, basically, you have to watch it like this. If you're trying to look for me anyways. I think I'm only like in two or three parts. But anyways, yeah. Anyways, back to this. If you want to know. Sorry, my hair is a mess, huh? Oh, well. It's because I'm not going anywhere today. This is how I look when I'm at home. Besides all this makeup. So anyways, if you like this look and you want to know how I achieved it. It is using all my Beauty Mark products. And don't forget to check out www.mybeautymark.net and use my promo code Miss A. Fuentes and you could get a free gift with all of your online orders. And don't forget to check out our um, My Beauty Mark fan page because we are having a school orientation. We are signing up girls for updo hair classes and we always have like other things. Also don't forget to sign up for um, coupons and other stuff like going on. I'll just link all the information below but anyways here's the video. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing if you have and bye. Okay so first I'm going to start out by using e.l.f. eyelid primer and put that all over my eye and you know what else I forgot to do um, after I fill in my brows a little bit I use um, MAC Studio Finish Concealer and I just um, this is what it looks like and I just clean up underneath my brows okay and then I already have some MAC Painterly Paint Pot on my painters palette and I'm just gonna Put that all over my lid. Okay, so for the first color I'm going to use is from the My, My Beauty Mark palette, which looks like this. And it is the 20 piece collection. And I'm going to use this orange right here. And I'm going to take that with a big fluffy brush. And I'm going to put that from the crease up to the um, brow bone, almost. And this orange almost reminds me of Rule when it is applied. Applied I think it looks just like Rule which is right here and of course that is from MAC. So I think this orange from the My Beauty Mark 20 piece collection is a good dupe for that. 
After you put the orange, then I'm going to apply a red. This is from the 120 palette and this is the third edition. And I'm going to use this red up here. And I'm using a Sonia Kashuk brush and placing that again from the crease up. And just to blend out the harsh edges of the red, taking a, a little bit of orange and blending out the edges of the red. Next, I am going to take the purple from the 120 palette from my Beauty Mark, which is this dark purple. And if any of you are interested in getting more information about the palettes, check out the My Beauty Mark site because I do post videos, um, individual videos for each palette. Just to let you know. Okay, now once I have that orange, or sorry, this purple, I'm going back with the red with the Sonia Kashuk brush and blending out the edges from the purple. And then for a highlight color, I'm not going to use anything um, actually shimmery. I'm going to use a My Beauty Mark Cosmetic palette, and this is the contouring and blush palette, which looks like this. Um, and I'm only going to use these two colors actually and mix it for the highlight color. Not really a highlight, but basically just so it could blend into my skin tone. And then once that is done, I'm going to take this brush from my Beauty Mark. This is like my favorite, favorite crease brush. And it's labeled a lip brush, but... I just love how it's so um, dense and small and it gets right into your crease. So I'm going to apply that um, black actually. I'm going to apply black in my crease area. Next I'm going to apply this pigment from my Beauty Mark and this is in G08. Um, I'm going to use Fix Plus for my brush and this is a MAC 213 I love the way this stuff smells so anyways and just pat it on your lid and then I am just going to use this NYX um, black pencil. I don't really like it. Um, they're really dry. But um, I'm just going to use it anyways. But they're not my favorite. And I would never get them again. So what I do when I use the NYX crappy dry pencils. Um, I use my, my Beauty Mark eyebrow um angled brush and I dip it in black and then I go right on top of the liner I just put. Alrighty, then I'm gonna just brush off all this fallout I got on my face. Um, and then I'm going to use the ALF Mineralize Infuse Mascara. And in my opinion, this mascara is really good when you're going to apply false lashes. Because for me, I like to apply the mascara first and then the lashes. Um, some people like it. Some people like to do it the other way around. But I prefer to put mascara because I don't really like getting too much mascara on my false lashes. So, um, with this mascara, it doesn't really do anything to your lashes. 
besides make them look um a little more fuller and like spread out just fuller basically but it doesn't like look really clumpy so I think it's good for applying false lashes because with the um, Maybelline falsies it'll make my lashes look really thick I don't know that's just the way I like to do it so um anyways I'm going to be using 415 lashes these are 100% um, human hair so I'm going to apply those so I'm going to apply the false lashes and then I will be right back. Um, okay, so then after I do that, I'm going to apply, um, or will use some toner to clean my skin a bit. So we're going to do that. And then I'll go in with the, um, My Beauty Mark. Uh, this is the concealer palette, which looks like this. And it's really good for, um, obviously concealing certain spots, but it's good also for full coverage. And, um, it doesn't have to be really thick either. You could use, um, a little bit of moisturizer to, um, to give it less coverage, you could say. So the colors I like to use under my eyes are this one and this one. So I'm just going to take a little bit of that and put it on my painter's palette and then I am going to use, I don't even know where I got this brush, I believe it was in one of those Walmart sets and just put it under my eyes. I'm going to use the My Beauty Mark um, Contour and Blush Palette. And I am going to use this color right here for my face just a little bit because I did already apply that concealer lightly. Okay, so after that, I still have a little bit of the um painterly paint pot on my palette and i'm going to use okay i'm going to use a little bit of the kirkland my my makeup area is a mess sorry if i'm obviously all over the place i'm gonna put a little bit of the elf eyelid primer blend that out with this kirkland brush Okay, so now I'm going to get a little bit of the My Beauty Mark Gel um, Liner in black on my painter's palette. And you could get these at the school if you're in our area and you want to go buy um, the My Beauty Mark School. Everything on the website plus more is at the school. So they are also carrying the painter's palettes and the spatulas. And then, this is the lip brush that I told you about that I love also. And I'm going to take some of the red from the 120 palette. And again, still using the third edition. And I'm just going to put some of that red. After that, I'm going to use the My Beauty Mark 20 piece and get that same purple and apply also on top of the red and then from that 20 piece palette I'm using the black and applying that just on the outer corners so this is basically what the look looks like and the last finishing touch which is my favorite little touch to put on this is my favorite it is the my beauty mark um quads and this is the aqua barbie and my favorite one is this one i don't know if you can really see but i've made a pretty good dent in there it looks white but it really gives a nice um 
like uh I don't know if it's showing up. Okay. I don't know if you could see it a little better, but you see the difference between this one and over here.